Hello everyone, this is Market Daily, where I bring you the latest in trends and money. Today I'm going to discuss a company that was recently added to ARK to 3D printing ETF PRNT on uh, January 15, 2021. The company is Pyro Genesis, a Canadian company listed on Toronto Stock Exchange under ticker PYR and you can buy it in OTC for US markets under ticker PYRNF. The company already filed for NASDAQ listing on February 2nd, 2021 and will likely be approved pretty soon. Now I understand that Robinhood does not allow um, trading over the counter securities and pink sheet stocks but you need to keep an eye for this ticker when it hit uh, NASDAQ later this month. So now some information about this uh, business. The company has five business component the uh, aluminum and zinc draws recovery it is a proven salt free cost effective sustainable process for maximizing metal recover from draws this process avoids costly loss of metal while reducing a smelter's carbon footprint and energy consumption just providing a higher return on investment the system has been designed to process and recover valuable metals such as aluminum, zinc and copper from draws. So this is like recycling 2.0 with um, 98% aluminum recover which is 20% higher than rotation rotary salts furnace and about 50% lower operating expense than uh, rotary salts furnace. So plasma Atomization. It is uh, a system invented by Pyrogenesis. It provides plasma atomized metallic powders with some of the most pure, dense, and highly flowable properties, which are highly sought after in the additive manufacturing industry. The global 3D printing metal market was valued at around 772 million USD in 2019. And uh, this is expected to grow at a uh, compound annual growth rate of 27.8% until 2027. The global 3D printing metal market is, in, is, is expected to witness substantial growth in the coming years, accelerating growth in the adoption of 3D printing for manufacturing of metal parts, especially in the aviation and healthcare industry. I think Art tries to tap on the global 3D metal printing market by going after the companies that make the metal ink, which is Pyro's Genesis, and the company that actually prints, which is Nano Dimension. So it's like a vertical logistics system, and there would be so much cross-selling between Art individual holdings. Furthermore, thanks to its lightweight and its ability to withstand the stresses that occur during launch and operation in space. Aluminium has been used on Apollo spacecrafts, the space shuttles and the International Space Station. Pyrogenesis Metal Inc. can also be used to print replaceable parts of spacecraft or may be used by robots to print metal components of in outer space or even Mars. So thus, in my opinion, Pyrogenesis is not far from being also added to Arc Space Exploration Index. Now, let's take a look at the company Financial Health. Pyrogenesis recorded revenue of $8 million in the third quarter of 2020. It represents an increase of 289% compared to $2 million recorded in the third quarter of 2019. Drawsat technology, which only introduced in quarter three of 2020, brought in 80% of company revenue, which is really impressive. It shows Pyrogenesis' ability to inventing new, to invent new technologies and profit from it. From it, and of course, let's not forget about insiders ownership. Pyrogenesis has 48% ownership by insiders, which is great. The price as of today is $5.4, which is somewhat still penny category, but I guess it won't be here for long. ARK has history in picking up penny stock. 
and making them into respectable company. Pyrogenesis is another example of such companies. In my opinion, this is one of the decent buying opportunities right now. Once it hits Nasdaq, probably in late Feb, people will buy it even more and it will shoot up the price. Thank you for watching this video. Feel free to like and subscribe for more content and research.